Our lesson today is about electric power and energy. Objectives. At the end of this presentation, the students should be able to give different forms of energy, give the meaning of the inscriptions of electric appliance, calculate the power of the electric appliance using P equal U times I. Forms of energy. There are different forms of energy. Electric energy, mechanical energy, heat energy, chemical energy, and radiant energy. According to the law of conservation of energy, energy is conserved, is neither created nor destroyed, but transformed from one form to another. For example, if we have a dry cell and a lamp, the dry cell is a converter. The energy in the dry cell is a chemical energy, converts it to electric energy. The lamp. The energy received by the lamp is electric energy. The lamp is a converter. Transform this energy into radiant energy and thermal energy. Electric power. Many household appliances carry two inscriptions. For example, incandescent lamp carries the inscription 220 volt and 110 watt. What is the meaning of each inscription? 220 volt means rated voltage, voltage needed to function normally. 110 watt is the rated power, power consumed during its normal functioning. Electric power Activity Incandescent lamp L carries the inscriptions 40 volt and 20 watt. The lamp functions normally and the current passes through it is 0.5 ampere. What does each indication mean? 40 volt is the rated voltage, voltage needed to function normally. 20 watt is the rated power, power consumed during its normal functioning. Find the product U times I of the voltage U across the, the lamp and the current I passes through it during its normal functioning. U times I equal 40 times 0 0.5 equal 20 Watt. Compare the power P and U times I. We observe that P equal U times I. I conclude that P equal U times I, where P is the power and its SI unit is Watt. U is the voltage and its SI unit is Volt. I is the electric current and its SI unit is Ampere. Thank you.